एक काम करता मैं ले मैं तो कहीं लिंक भेजा फुल लिंक भेजा एक बार साथ रहता था देख नहीं है भाई वॉइस अलग अलग वांट थ्री वांट थ्री हाँ तो बहुत है बस तो नहीं है भाई Professor Rodin tends to go on a bit. Can you hear me? Hello. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get out of the lesson. We've had to rely on each other when our parents are about. My older sisters taught me everything I needed to know about Hogwarts before I stepped foot in the castle, including how to sneak food from in the kitchen. Why is it all the boring potions? When are we learning Felix Felicis? Knowing Sharp is Felicis. Probably teach it after we've done our exam. Knowing Sharp is Felicis. Have you ever noticed in potions that the girl who sits in the corner almost always nearly melts a cauldron? I find it quite disconcerting, and Sharp doesn't even raise an eyebrow. Yet I drop one nettle too many, and I get the stare of the basilisk. I don't find potions bearable at all. And if it's double potions, I question whether I wouldn't just rather be a. Hello. Do you find it hard to get the right consistency in a confusing concoction? I can never get mine to thicken. Five times on. I got it. I fell asleep in Transfiguration once. Professor Weasley woke me up, and I had drool all over my wand. Couldn't transfigure the walls of that. When Helen said draw a flesh drop, how was I to know you were drawing next to a dead body? I've been meaning to ask you. Would you have an extra coin at the bottom, or would you? I dropped one of the crystal balls in divination. Shattered everywhere. I was mortified. I will say that Professor and I seemed much calmer than I expected. Still, not ideal. Honestly, the way some of those Slytherins fall all over Professor Black, it's embarrassing. He doesn't look like a fool by it. Then again, what isn't he irritated? Hello. Get away from me! I just took a snuggle off pod for a puff of pod the other day and just one, two, three. Okay, that mistake again anytime soon. In my blood, my mother says. Hello. On her side, at least. Hello. As a muggle born, I used to feel like a muggle born. Here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to Year Five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work. But I am confident that we will take hold with the passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page five one seven. But before we begin. Can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm. 
Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Hello. Only one hello, book hello, hello. will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Hello. 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 Now we have learned this spell. Akio. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me! We'll be starting again, bro. We'll be starting again. Yeah, new game. It's clear, you know? <sighs> I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> <laughs> so why don't we have our newest student start us off? Hmm? <laughs> Very simply, cast Akio from one of the spheres and relinquish your excellent control there. Now, uh, think of this. That's it! Good. Points to Gryffindor. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Miss Onai can be ready. Full key, each little one, that did a key, each little one, that Very good! Here we go! Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we?
<laughs> oh. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter, focus now, you will need it. This round settles it all. He's up. Excellent control there. Let us see you. Watch this. There we go. Not exactly your typical lesson, is it? Not a Good, both of you. Well done. That's my second ball also entered. Oh. That's the talent. Games clean just to make it better. Games clean just to make it better. Games clean just to make it better. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. Mm? I must admit, I think I underestimated you. It took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I do your love. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Well, it's been nice talking and competing with you. And with you. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. And... Of course. You can use a word you if you would, if you're so inclined. You wanted to speak with me, Professor. I did. I trust you. What? You did. Thank you, Professor. <laughs> Miss Onai is always. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Stop it, please. You'll get us in trouble. In trouble? 
What about the room, Professor? Oh, I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hackett and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a strailer. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Now you're going to the church. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spellcrafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find... I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallo or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallo is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavoury local, best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that, the Mending Charm Reparo. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for today. See them through and then report back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time.
I'll complete the tasks. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Must be around here somewhere. Might some kind soul help me? If I was a flying page, we're all there. If only a new student was having. I trust the preliminary task. I completed the assignments, Professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. That's it! Very good! If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. Glad you could make it. Lucan's just over there. Repair it. Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. How does cross wands work exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. It's our way of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? 
together. Of course. Jewels is an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Cross Ones, you can duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. So, care to step into the ring? Let's go. Get me in the ring. Spectacular! Let the fireworks begin! Let's go beat up some kids. We'll make you regret signing up. Huh. Shut up. I wanted to talk to you about crossed wands. Ah, so care to try your luck again? Get me in the ring. That's what I like to hear. We'll make you regret signing up. The lady also spells needed to break their shields here. Need to break their hair or shields. It's also awesome. the winner. It's also. Awesome. school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Anytime, anytime. Hope to see you back here again. Hugs me. 
way to go shut the one down. Is that a suit of armor talking to me? Hello? Well, fancy meeting you here. Sebastian. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, I shall endeavour to be the very best of guides, then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained, too. We should be able to find you everything that you need. Shall we? I was glad Professor Weasley asked me to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. They might be of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Speaking of Weasley, she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. Has she? That's nice to hear. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention record. Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough. 